Well, here in the Valley, the Discovery Children's Museum is more than a fun place to go with your family. It's an art studio, a science lab, and even an archaeological dig site. And now the museum is honoring the Win Las Vegas for helping to fund some of its educational exhibits. Good morning. This is Tif Tiffany, right? Did yes. I say it right? You said it right. <laughs> Perfect, Melissa. Thank you so much for joining us here this morning. Thank you. Why don't you tell us a little bit about um, why you're honoring the Win and kind of what they've done for you guys. So Win Las Vegas has been very supportive of the museum. Uh, they've allowed us to launch an outreach program that allows us to expand the audience that we reach in the community. So we go into community festivals, we set up an art studio basically, so the families can have an experience and get familiar with what the, um, the museum offers. And then we invite those families back into the museum so that they can experience the education there at the museum. And you are honoring them at your annual gala. We are. Our annual <laughs> gala, that's on the 15th, Saturday the 15th and um, of October. Uh, Wynn has been very supportive, not only with um, funding and support monetarily, but they've also volunteered and helped us at several events and those volunteer events out in the community. So they've been very, very supportive over the past few years. And we just wanted to say thank you <laughs> to them for being such a great community supporter. And you guys are nonprofit, so the community support that you receive is important and it all kind of flushes back to the kids, right? It's very, very important. We would not be able to do some of the things that we do that most people don't even see. Like we have a high school program that teaches work development skills. We wouldn't be able to do that without having that support from the community um, and, and corporations like um, Win Las Vegas. We wouldn't be able to serve the 25,000 school children that we bring in from Title I schools to experience the education at the museum. And not just experience that education, but it's also correlated to the state standards. So it goes along with what the teachers are teaching in the schools. And that's important too because they're getting these hands-on experiences that they may not get either inside a classroom or even at home. It brings it to life for them and gives them exposure to experiences that they might not otherwise have. And those experiences we know can change their lives. So again, um, let's go over the gala one more time and just kind of, um, we'll put some information up there on the screen. Just kind of explain what it's going to be like. It's, it's supposed to be beautiful, right? Black tie oh, affair. It's and <laughs> black tie with the whimsical flair. It's really cool. There'll be entertainment there. There's a silent auction with cocktails provided by Southern Glacier Wine and Spirits. There is going to be entertainment. Um, La Rev, the Dream will be performing as well as Steve Wynn's Showstoppers. So it's really going to be a great time. And these entertainers are some of the best in the world, oh, in my opinion. Yes. Amazing. <laughs> so you can't miss it, right? Absolutely. You have to be there. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much for coming in this morning. We'll make sure we get this information on our website, too, and we'll be right back after this.